Station News Now Storm Tracker Weather. Coverage you can count on. So, Court, we're getting closer to the weekend, which, of course, you know, if you just kind of go by the last couple of weeks, that means we're cooling down. Yeah, in fact, uh, that's what's happening. Right. You head into the latter part of your work week. Today, still very warm, still mostly mild out there as far as temperatures go, with them hovering a little above average tomorrow, much cooler. And we also have the chance for showers and thunderstorms moving in as we head into your Friday. We're tracking a little bit of active weather tonight in an area where. We thought there may be a chance there is some active weather developing in the northern mountains right now. It's going to become more widespread tomorrow. Cooler with some showers on Sunday as well, or excuse me, Saturday. Sunday we're mostly drying out and we're also warming up as we head into your Sunday forecast. Now as far as what we're seeing outside today, right now Chico, 91 degrees, skies partly cloudy. We are seeing some thin clouds overhead. Winds are out of the southeast to 21 miles an hour. So it is windy out there. That's really the start of the impacts that we're going to be seeing from that low pressure moving in. 91 degrees right now for Redding. Redding has had a bit of a break in the clouds with south winds to 12 miles an hour. Redding had some much gustier winds about an hour ago. Meanwhile, 79 degrees in Bernie with partly to mostly cloudy skies and winds out of the southwest to around 5 miles an hour. Getting a look at the satellite and radar this afternoon, you can see those clouds moving on up. And take a look at this. We've got some active weather rolling into portions of the northern mountains. So northern Trinity and Siskiyou County seeing pockets of heavy rain and a little thunderstorm activity moving in this evening. That was expected. We talked about that a little bit yesterday ahead of the main Band of active weather that's going to be moving through tomorrow. So, what we have going on, high pressure down to our south and east, still having a pretty decent influence over our region today, keeping us mostly dry and very warm. Low pressure off the coast that starts to move towards our region over the next 12 to 24 hours. That results in that active weather becoming more widespread heading into your Friday. So, early to midday, we start to see the active weather in the northern mountains. By around mid to late in the day, we start to see that chance for showers and thunderstorms also in the North Valley in Sierra as well as the foothills. Mid Valley areas around a 40% chance for some showers and thunderstorms. It does look much more likely up to the north. And then some lingering showers on the way for your Saturday, drying out and warming up as we head into your Sunday forecast. And then we're even warmer as we head through next week. Getting a look at what we're going to be seeing outside on Friday. Showers and the chance for thunderstorms looking fairly likely for the northern mountains with temperatures in the mid-60s to low 70s in your afternoon. By the afternoon and evening, that's when we have the chance for active weather rolling into the Sierra and Cascades. Temperatures there in the high 60s to mid-70s for your Friday. Foothill areas also expected to see that chance for active weather mainly late in the afternoon into the evening. Temperatures there in the high 60s to low 70s. And if you're in the valley overnight, low to mid 60s for the start of your Friday morning with partly cloudy skies. And then we start to see that chance for active weather mid to late day. Highs tomorrow, high 70s to low 80s. A pretty decent drop compared to what we saw outside today. We're also going to have winds out of the south to 15 miles an hour. Gusts tomorrow up to 30 miles an hour. Mid valley areas, mid 60s for the start of your Friday. The chance for some active weather mainly in the afternoon and evening. Highs tomorrow in the low 80s, and we're also seeing a slight chance for some thunderstorm activity as we head towards tomorrow evening as well. Your Storm Tracker 7 day forecast where your weekend's always in view. Low 80s and a chance for showers and thunderstorms on Friday in Chico. Not as likely to see wet weather on Saturday, but temperatures cooler with mid 70s, then drying out with mid 80s Sunday, and then we're back to the low to mid 90s with dry weather early to midweek next week. Redding, you'll be seeing high 70s and a decent chance for showers and thunderstorms as we head through your Friday. Low 70s on Saturday with a slight chance for some light showers. And then dry with mid 80s Sunday. Low 90s Monday and Tuesday. And then Haley, we're back to the mid 90s as we head towards the middle of next week.